Okay, so we are back. We are here ready to do the Summer I Turn Pretty, the second episode. Um, the first episode ended with Belly going off to try to find um, Cam on the dawn whale watching internship boat or whatever, even though it was well past dawn, I feel like, by the time she got out there. But uh, we're going to see what happens. Um, so far, um, I'm feeling very much like Conrad is such a piece of trash. I know that she loves him, and I know she's loved him forever, but I am not about this Conrad. Um, I'm sure, because I sort of know what's going on, that in the past, he was a different sort of Conrad, and not so much now. Um, Jeremiah is a delight and absolutely lovely towards her. Um, Cam is, so far sweet, we shall see. But I think the biggest difference that I sort of felt was that um, their mom and Suzanne, or Susanna, I forget, um, are supposed to be like thick as thieves. And I didn't really get that impression. Like sort of the whole point is that their parents, these two women have been best friends for like since college or whatever. And they've gone through everything together and they will go through anything together and for each other. And it didn't really feel entirely like that in the first episode. But we shall see. Um, in the interim between the time I filmed the last episode and the time I'm filming this one, I have um, downloaded the book two from the library. I intend to start it tomorrow. So maybe by the time I get to episode three, I will have more to say about what came from which book. Maybe not. We'll see. But that said... Let's just get started. Let's get going. So here we are. Um, the Summer I Turned Pretty, episode two. Too old for it. Oh, maybe should have... Oh, see? I told you. There's no way! This, so this is picking up exactly where the last episode Sometimes left off. It kind of feels like no matter how hard I try, I just keep missing the boat. Oh, but it's so far past dawn. What happened? Belly is going to be a debutante. Oh, <laughs> how fun really for everyone. I forgot to look really up who that lady was. Shut up, creepy. Why is he so mean? I don't have an older brother, but is it typical that they're so mean? <laughs> my husband was mean to his younger sister. No, oh, don't worry, Laura, it's on me. It was my idea after all. And wow, guys, stop fighting over me. <laughs> oh, poor um, Belly. I'm not going with either of you. I am going to find my own date. Uh, Wikipedia says debutante balls require instruction in morals and social etiquette. I'm going for a swim. See ya. She could use some etiquette. <laughs> no offense, so Beck, mean. I don't feel like a country club is the best place to teach Belly about morals. I think Lorelai needed like... No, I think Rory needed like 12 sets of pantyhose for her coming out party. See, here's the problem with this. Because... No. But because she's adorable, she's gonna look good in pretty much anything. Mom doesn't look so... Oh my god, that is a wedding dress and a half. That is absolutely a wedding dress. Oh, I think they're all wedding dresses. What have I done? She looks like a cupcake. Oh, I like it from the waist down. She looks like the tooth fairy. I don't like it from the waist up. At that detail. Everybody's eyes will fall out of their heads when they see our girl. <laughs> or what about this one? Oh, no, no, no. That one's much too simple. Oh, she likes that like one. Belly. Lord, trust me. This it doesn't look so good on the that. on the hanger. I would love to, uh, Are you on break? Oh, I thought he was going in. You're wearing a hairnet. Oh, you fucked up. What? How could I have already fucked up? Nobody's gonna want to hook up with you after they see you. <laughs> you should have been a lifeguard with me. Oh, and hardly anyone drowns. <laughs> this is all ours. Like 
Like, she knows you're trying to avoid her. Honey? See? Hey, hon? Yeah. Would you change and meet me out back? I want to paint your portrait first. Why me? Because everyone else has things to do. She's reading Laurel's book. I have things to do too, Mom. I think you can spare a few hours for your mother. <laughs> See her? Yeah. And my friend. <laughs> and uh, the one in the blue. And the uh, guy with eyebrows. <laughs> You're just such a slut, man. Okay, I just like to kiss and be cozy with people. Oh, yeah. I've never kissed her, though. What? Why is she wearing that at the pool? Yeah, keep it that way. Okay, all right. So Shayla's cute and all, but I'd avoid getting sucked in. Sucked. <laughs> I sucked in the look. To all that. Can you not see her? Girls in sundresses are on my kryptonite, but I've never let one talk me into being an escort. Oh my god, the hat. No! Oh my gosh. Billy, I just want you to know that if you decide you hate it, or if the girls are mean, or even if the food is bad, you can text me. I promise I won't say I told you so. I'll be fine. You oh my god. Uh, Belly, wow, I didn't even recognize you. Tell me the truth. Um, do I look like a fool? Yeah, um, kinda. Uh, no, you look good. Oh. Okay. Uh, let me walk over. I'm so nervous. Okay. I, I still never thought I'd see you wearing them. Fascinating. <laughs> oh, they're all wearing them. Oh, I feel so much better. They don't like her, but at least they're all wearing hats. No one Oh my god. That's what? the girl Conrad was kissing at the bonfire. Oh no, red and red socks. Stephen was with. Oh. FML. Why she was dressed like that. That girl looks like she's 12. And Nicole looks so much lemon jelly belly. Younger in this outfit. Is that from the other night? Haley, fix it. I think we're good. Yes, thank you. But though. Oh. How's Nicole? Mom, can we not do this? Like, no, I, I, you asked me to come sit for this portrait, and, and, and I'm here, and I'm sitting, and I'm more than happy to be here, but can we not make this like a bonding experience, please? Well, excuse me for trying to connect with my son before he leaves for a year. <laughs> if you want to spend your summer moping around, I can't stop you, but <laughs> no more sleeping till two, no more day drinking. I want you doing something productive. And what is that, Mom? You're getting a job. Oh, all right. Sure. Yeah, but Cousins likes to pretend to be woke. Mm -hmm. Trust me, my family deals with it constantly. The things we do for college applications. That's oh, insane. Don't worry, Miss. We're getting everywhere. Mm -hmm. Wait, where are you applying? You know, the usual. Every Ivy. Minus Cornell. Mm -hmm. If the guy is so bleak. <laughs> yeah, I know. What about you? Oh, Belly's only a sophomore. Gigi oh. has had this thing. <laughs> For Jeremiah? Ever since he got abs. <laughs> <laughs> no, Jeremiah's the nice Relax. one. Relax, I'm not into Jeremiah for sure. Yeah, and you're noticing his abs? No. No. She's too busy eye fucking the waiter. She's <laughs> Belly's brother. <laughs> write a better book than Clinton or Clifford or whatever that dude's name was. Maybe. I don't know. I've never read any of your books. Oh, I understand some of you might think that Debbing is outdated. What is it's she doing? Something you're doing to is she drinking under the table? But the Cousins debutante ball is a part of history. I've seen TV Venerated, before. yet ever evolving. It's a tradition you'll some... Debs? 
At each table is a big sister who will guide you through the season. So please introduce yourselves. Hey, little sis. <laughs> Honestly, my parents made me do it last year because I don't like all the women in my family have done it. But my big sis was great, and I actually ended up having a lot of fun. Oh, so just, I'm nervous. Don't be nervous. But I'm nervous that you're going to, like, okay. turn on her. Do you want some? Like, pretend to be nice and then stab her in the um, back. No, thanks. I'm good. I'll be right back. Kim! Belly, what are hey, you Kim's doing? Hey, Kim's here. Wait, are you a dev? Yeah, I guess. Technically, yes. Cool. Nice. <laughs> I, I went down to Marina <clears throat> yesterday, but uh, your boat had already left. Seriously, man. Yeah, if you had looked back toward the pier, you would have seen a, a sweaty version of me looking wistfully toward your boat. Well, we never want you to be wistful. You know, I think it's mm -hmm. too late. Well, do you think going to a drive-in movie with me tonight might help with the wistfulness? Sure. Yeah, I think it would. Cool. <laughs> uh, you know what? You give me this. Can what is it? Oh. Information? <laughs> I think that should be good. Sweet. Oh, that's delightful. <laughs> I mean, the hat's... I can't stop looking at that terrible hat. You are gonna have so much fun tonight. We're just going to see a movie. You look nice, hon. I can't believe crop tops are back. That's how I thought it was such hot shit in that baby tee I wore freshman year. <laughs> have fun tonight. Are you not driving with us? She didn't even. Didn't Belly tell you? Tell her mom she, she wasn't a going. Date. <laughs> It's fine. Why? Of course you can go. I'm distracted to enough of these book parties over the years. Oh. Have a great date. She didn't go. Oh, it's the book party? Do we need to talk about consent before you go? Um. Maybe I said all I have to say. Maybe I don't have any books left in me anymore. You haven't done anything since your divorce. You gotta get out there, replenish the well, have fun. It's go true. To Hard to find things to write about if you don't do anything. Nice. Um, See you guys later. Bye. She does look adorable. Look hot. <laughs> hey, 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 stop flirting with my sister. Shut up, Steven. Hey, you shut up. Steven's a jerk. You look good, though. <laughs> that was nice. I'm not going to the book party. I'm going to the drive-in. Hi. Hi. You look less wistful. I, uh, <laughs> I feel less wistful. <laughs> what movie are we seeing? Uh, it's some old movie called uh, Sabrina. Audrey Hepburn? Two Brothers? That's Sabrina? I think so. Yeah, yeah I, I love that movie. It got really great views. <laughs> watch the movie. How much do you watch each other? Look at how smiley I am. This is adorable. But this isn't even a love triangle. This is like a love square. There's three guys who want Belly right now. Cam, Conrad, and Jeremiah. Not Steven, thankfully. Oh, they're at the book party. Hey, Mom said no more day drinking. It's night, so feel free. That's a lot if that's whiskey. It's probably not so bad if it's wine, but... Pretty cover. I really liked it. Oh, it's him. You read my book? Yeah. Yeah, I thought it was uh, really interesting how you made uh, Iris an unreliable narrator. In what way? <laughs> Just uh, how the story she was telling us about her marriage, I mean, so clearly wasn't the real story. <laughs> I'm not sure that's entirely true, but okay. Great to meet you, Cleveland. Can't wait for the next one. Yeah, me too. Huh. So, what is the next one? It's mainly about sailing. Oh, sort of a uh, modern epic. 
You sail? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you surprised? Is it the Moby Dick? <laughs> kind of. I thought you were like a Brooklyn hipster. Mm -hmm. Do people say hipster anymore? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. But you're right. They're I not going to get together, are they? Come over here. This is Cleveland. He's it's writing about sailing, but not also knows nothing about sailing. Conrad's a great sailor. You won a regatta last year, right? Came in second, but um, that could be his job for the uh, summer. I research assistant. Well, I could uh, use some lessons. <laughs> you know, this shit is so boring. Come Maybe he can like be her mentor and teach yeah, her how where? to use Instagram. We could go into town. He could teach me how to use Instagram. That would be good too. I got arrested last summer. Oh, <laughs> shit, really? Yeah. You know, we could go to the drive-in. Can, um, can I ask you a question? Yeah. Why marine biology? Oh, why not? I just, I feel like it was a, um, a phase that everyone goes through when they're little. But it, you stuck with it. Yeah. <laughs> There's a jellyfish with Benjamin Button's disease. Hmm? What? <laughs> Scientists think it's immortal. Nobody knows why, though. Interesting. Like it could be like the cure for cancer. But how do you harness jellyfish cells? I don't know. I don't know how to. I don't know either. Nobody does. Are you going to find out? Nuts. Marine? Um, eels? Nobody knows how eels reproduce. How do you not know that? Before last night, I'd only kissed boys during Spin the Bottle. Not in real life. Not because we both really want it. Oh no, the boys are gonna crash! But the way I feel right now, this Where is are what they? everyone talks about. They're coming. Here they are. <laughs> hey, could you, um, grab me that drink, actually? Maybe like a, a cherry coke or something? Yeah, no problem. Good. Thank you. Yeah. Yes, I'll be right back. Thanks. Mm. What the hell do you think you're doing? Uh, just catching the end of our favorite movie. You <laughs> have no right. You have to go. Oh, Billy, relax. We were just joking around. Steven, if you don't leave, I swear to God, I will send everyone in this car your Dramini fanfic. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't. Oh, he spent an entire chapter talking about Draco's wand. Let's go, guys. Oh, that's oh, nice. Steven, drive the car. You were the one who wanted to come, Conrad. But he cares about Belly in his own weird way. Unlike you, Steven, you mean brother. What are you up to, hon? Uh... Yeah, yeah, just video games. Don't stay up too late. You've got work early in the morning tomorrow. All right, Mom. He knows when he works. Not that I'm trying to be on his side or anything. I had a really good time tonight. Did you also? Yeah, no, I had a really, I had a really great time. I think I was just dehydrated. Poor kid. <laughs> Are you hydrated? No? Yeah, very. <laughs> I don't want this night to be over. Well, consent speech not needed. Where as far as you know, all three boys are in there. Oh, she's reading it. Jeremiah. I, I know it's kind of lame, but I think we'd have fun together. Will you be my date to the devil? Oh. Escort. Oh, I get it now. <laughs> oh, no.
was your hot date. Excuse me? Okay, relax. We were just having a little fun. You guys are assholes. Why can't you have fun at someone else's expense? All I wanted was to go to a drive-in with a guy that I think is, is cute and sweet, and, and you guys had to come and ruin it. And us showing up for like two minutes ruined that, really? Grow up, Billy. Why couldn't you let me have this one thing? Huh? Admit it. You knew what you were doing. What? What was I doing? Reminding me that you existed. I don't know what you're talking about. You cared where I was, who I was with. No, I didn't. I think you did. I don't care. Stop lying. Stop being such a baby. Oh, and you're such an adult. You spent your Saturday night crashing my first date for fun. Why don't you go smoke some more pot? See, the problem... Don't you look in the mirror some more. Oh... See the I wonder if this is the way all crushes die. It's not over. With a whimper, slowly, and then just like that, gone. All right, so here's, like, the problem, if you will. Um, the problem is that we, or those of us who have read the book, know why Conrad's being such an asshole. I don't really think it's a good reason, but there is, in fact, an actual reason. So, I almost want to give him the benefit of the doubt. I'm not going to, but I can see why people might. Um, but it's just so hard to watch him be such an asshole. Um, but it's obvious that he likes Belly. It's obvious that Cam likes Belly, and it seems highly plausible that Jeremiah also likes Belly, at least from what we're watching here. Um, and I do also feel like a total moron because I didn't pick up on the fact that debutantes have escorts and that the woman or the girl who is currently making out with Stephen on the beach is not a prostitute, but she needed an escort to the ball. I'm kind of stupid for that, but let's just forget about that part. But anyway, um... But it is very hard to watch um, Conrad be such a complete and utter asshole. My God. Um, but here we are, watching him be a complete and utter asshole. Um, am I going to watch another episode? I mean, I've already watched two. There are only seven. Plus, between now and the next episode, I do plan to read the second book. So, And then here's the thing. This debutante ball has to, has to, has to, has to be a plot point in one of these books, right? It's too big of a thing to have just decided for no reason to have a debutante ball. So maybe it's in the second book. I'll find out when I read it tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to finish it along and we will see how it goes. So um, I guess that's it. Um, thanks for watching and come back soon and um, I will try to amuse you. All right. Bye.